closes, then some of the black farm is not there. Then in the process of being closes, the devil takes that opportunity to work back on their mind. To bring them back into the original state. Oh my God. So now my church open now. They ain't want to come to church no more. You see that? Yeah. Because now their mind has already been entangled with, with a lot of stuff that they was free from one time ago. Now they went back to it. And the devil picked it up. Good. John 10 10. What is it? The thief cometh not but for to steal and to kill and to destroy. So, you hear that? The thief, who is what? The devil, comes to what? What Satan mission? What is his greatest assignment to you? This is personal. He comes to do what? The first thing? He comes to thief, to rip you off, to steal what he's taking from you. What he's taking from you. I want you to know this. Please write this down. What he's taking from you. What the thief is taking from you. He's taking your identity. Because if you don't know who you are, it means that you don't know who Christ is. Once he takes your identity, that is it, that, that, that who you, who God has purposed you to be, then you can never do what God called you to do. And in not doing what God called you to do, you're not giving God glory. So the thief will take your identity. This is what he did to, uh, this is what he tried to get to Adam. Because Adam then not only lost dominion, I mean the power and the control, the capability to control the whole world, that was not the only thing. Adam lost his identity, my God. That's why God had to come. To restore man back to his original identity. My God, amen. The man of Peter, in, in, in Matthew 16, when Jesus asked the disciples, who do man say that I am? And then uh, Simon bar Jonah answered, said, thou art the Christ, the Son of the living God. And Jesus says, blessed be thou, Simon bar Jonah, for flesh and blood has not revealed us not give us revelation. Flesh and blood has not been revealed us unto you, but my Father which art in heaven. Then he says, your name are Peter, not Simon. Simon was the name that the mama and daddy gave him. But that was not his destiny name. His identity was, 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 was Peter. And upon this revelation, I can build my church. Upon this revelation, I can build my church. And the gates of hell will not prevail against it. The gates of hell will not, my God. That means the gates of hell will make a tell. But it will not prevail against it because you're standing on the revelation of who Jesus Christ is. Amen. His identity has been restored. Now he knows his purpose now. Amen. And the next chapter later, the devil run after him quickly. Because the devil don't want you to know who you are. Hallelujah. Amen. He doesn't want you to know, amen, that you have the capability by the by the grace of God, the by and the loose. Hallelujah. He doesn't want you to know that you have you you are legal to operate in this realm and the spiritual realm. The devil can't operate in this physical realm except he got a body. He needs somebody that are legal to operate in the physical dimension. Y'all know what I'm saying? Amen. So a lot of times we say the devil is so strong, the devil needs 